All right, everybody, and welcome to a round of capitals on classic. This is fog and blizzards with classic. So I haven't played this setting in a while, but uh, playing it tonight. So here we go. This is on my main account. My main account right here. So. Here we go. Make sure the stats are on and territories and C for continents. The continent overlay. All right. We got a Kamkasha capital. We got a Siam capital. That is a nice capital for orange. Oh, uh, blue take or white takes it from me. All right, then we got a I think cam Kacha works well because white has already put it in there, so I don't need to worry about it, but I will be next to fours of white, and he's only guaranteed five troops, and that's a six. 9v6 capitals possible with a four. four next to it. Um, it's a six. I think I put it, I think I still put it on the three. Yeah. All right. Oh, pink puts it right there. At least I know where the cap's at not to open them now if he ever takes North America. Good to know. All right. Red puts it in Africa. We're going to see orange and red fight. Nice. So we see one, two, three, four caps. We don't see blue's cap. I'm going to assume blue's cap is in South America or in Central America. Right away, orange has got a really strong cap. Giving me a card. That is good. I have a card. Eight V three. Yep, that was expected. I have a card right here. So this is what I'm gonna take. So I'll do this. while fortifying my five to capital. All right, this is a good start for me. I don't need a card. I just need to take, or I'm sorry, I don't need um, a bonus to win this game. So my main concern is taking a card every turn. I know that pink's blocked off um, Asia and that he has to go through Iceland to get to Asia. So pink would be an easy card block. Okay, so red goes and takes one down there. So it gives me a card in, yeah, he gives me a card over there. That's good, okay. Take a card of my four, see what's going on over there. Open up three. Territories to see maybe I see something who knows Pink doesn't know my cap is on Cam Kacha, so this is good He won't know I'm here So he could be a bit lousy about his capital and give it to me Which would be huge for me All right They're getting five, orange, five, five, five. Okay, so we, we're seeing five on round two. No one's got a bonus. White probably takes Australia this turn. 
it could be worth to go look at White's capital right now. It would have to be less than a 20, 21, 20, 20, 19, 19 18. It'd have to be less than a seven for me to hit. But no, I'm going to play the safe bet in this. We're also going to open that we want to see what's going on. All right. No, blue's inside here. So he's not on, we know he's not there. Cool. Good to know that he's not on Central America. Blue could be the one, the first one to die. If this is the case though. Iceland. Okay, so he placed it on Iceland, came through. Cool. Does he hit? He could have just hit it. Oh, frick. Oh, maybe. We'll know if white doesn't get anything. It was a 24. He could have gotten really insane dice. Oh my God. He's slow rolling it. So this is good for me. I can go steal the cap now. White has two fours next to my cap as well. Red sees my cap. Orange does not see my cap. Orange is also blocked off. Yeah, he's hitting one. Okay, good. So I'm guessing he didn't get it. But I'm guessing it's like super open now. Well, I'm hitting that for sure. Yep. Do I just take? No. We'll leave that a... We'll split eights. Yep, split eights. Take Australia next turn. And we have a set if we need it. We do not need to do that though. I think my turn will consist of putting three on my eight, taking Australia, ending my turn. And or fortifying that to cap and then ending my turn. As long as we don't see any giant stacks coming out of here, because pink is right here. I doubt his stacks are huge. Yeah, that's what I thought. Four. Yep. Mm hmm <clears throat> Pink probably has that now. Red's not putting everything on cap is interesting we're gonna hope that white has no set we actually might kill white here if he had no set orange is not open to me besides through the pink four so there's no reason to be worried but he sets in and he goes and checks not worth you hitting that not worth it. He's going to hit my territory. He sees both of my capitals and hits my territory. Ends his turn, fortifies to cap. He does not have 12 territories, so we're good. Did blue get his bonus? Yes, he has his bonus. Why 
white. Does Y have a set? Hopefully not. Orange did set in early, so I could get this. I could set in now for six just to guarantee I get white's kill. Might be worth. I think I'm going to stay safe. Maybe. I think getting rid of white's important. I think he's going to bot out, though. I'm right, he puts it on uh, Siberia. Doesn't take a card? No, he gets one. Probably attacked your all. Um, the only place is here. I never saw red attack down. I think this needs to be at least 11. And a 12. If I get an extra 6, that would be very more protective. Killing white would probably not be the right answer. Trading in now would guarantee it. I think actually I do trade in. Make this a 12 to guarantee it. I get rid of white out of here. I think getting rid of the kill guard is more important. Just because I need the troops. In early game, it matters. Did pink get it? No. Did not get North America. Good to know. Red's only getting five. Oh, hitting blue. Orange. Fortifying is six. Hitting me. He knows he can't get it this turn. Okay. Does orange get the kill? I don't think so. No, he got it. He got the kill and he sets in for it too. With a 12, it's going to be an 8. 20v12 is not worth. 20v12 is not worth. You shouldn't do a 20v12. So me setting in was the right move. Oh, he's attacking more. What are you attacking? What? Yeah, fortify back. Okay. Also, I don't know what he was attacking that last part. I'm never going to open Cyan. Ever. So I leave that cap as is and keep adding to the others. So, yep. Make this a... 16, because it's the most important now. And we're going to attack orange a little bit to see what's going on. You've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 at max territories. All right. This is good. This is a good, this is a good start. Pink's going to see that. Alright, did Pink get his bonus? He did not. Still has not gotten his bonus. He's going to attack all of Red and even open him up. Okay. Pretty good start. I like I like this start because they gave me the capital in the bottom. Obviously, I fed the kill to uh, Orange, but I think it was worth it in the sense because I'm getting, I need to get the bonus set right away. And I didn't want I didn't want white to set in inside me. That would have hurt me huge big time. So
I don't know why Red added there. He got five troops, so he definitely still has the cap. He's not taking this, though, so... I'll get a card with my three this time. At least orange got hit a lot here. That's good. With that uh, orange one being on Siam, I don't need to make it the 16 very strong. But I do want to keep it fairly strong. Um, very versus fairly. So. The Kamkacha capital is more important. But, so. Like this. Obviously this will be my strong cap. That will be my secondary. But it, I should always keep this double the trade in. Obviously I'm not going to be able to do it at the beginning. But towards the end I will. See the capital. All right. He is open. Is he open? He is open to my 21. Yep. He can see it too. So I should get rid of orange. So he can't see my capital and Kim Kacha. I don't want him to see it for no reason and have access to it. I should be checking in on red's capital too. Blue is probably breaking pink all the time, so that's why he's not, that's why pink's not, or uh, pink's not getting his bonus, but blue is. I bet blue has either got his capital on Brazil or Venezuela, either or. Most likely Brazil, because that's why he's getting his bonus. Leaves three split, interesting. I have no reason to open pink ever. Yeah, orange doesn't like me. Is he taking four territories now? Five territories? You only hit five territories. That wasn't enough to take Europe. So. We'll see as embark this first. Interesting. Orange didn't set till five either. Um, I think I that's I definitely need to keep this cap bigger. Make sure I get rid of his access to see my other capital in the top right. He doesn't need to see that one. Bottom right one does not matter as long as he doesn't have a set big enough to take it, of course. And orange is going to be the first to get set ends. Oh, it's going to be a 25 set now. Ooh. That's not good. Orange is going to have a bigger set. He's forced to set in too. I can't believe Red set in. Did Red get his capital? He, he has his capital, yep, okay. But Orange gets the 25. Do I have a set on four? I do. One. Two. That's it, he ends his turn, okay. We don't want to open Middle East ever. That's why I want to be in Europe in center, Central Europe, because of that. I don't think I set in here, but I definitely make that a 20, 24. I put everything else here. All right, because if, if orange sets it on three, 
Mm. That's bad news for me. Red is probably fighting for all Africa, maybe? Oh, we saw a 3v1, though. So we don't know. If I was orange, I would not care if he had the bonus. But at the same time, it would hurt him. Orange is open to my capital, so hitting Ukraine wouldn't matter. Mm -hmm. If we can, if I can get that capital on Middle East, ooh, I'd be in a very good spot. Very good spot. I could possibly hold Asia, and no one would be able to do anything about it. And seven a turn, so it's basically 14 a turn plus the capital, so it's probably like 20 a turn. Holding Australia and, and Asia is like 14 a turn because of the territory. Um, Siberia, Western. Definitely Siberia. No. It took, right? Yeah, because I can. So we make this a 32. 40 it is actually and then we make this a four the rest of there open up orange to see what he is also be breaking him just in case he has the bonus because frick orange and also we don't want to block our capital to his capital i'm looking at it i think he's blocking red from uh no, but red has two access points into Europe anyway. I don't know what red what would be going on there. And why is orange's cap only a 39? Got 25 on his turn. He must have hit some stuff. We don't see what's... Did pink get the... No, it's America. no, he did not, but he's set in. It doesn't kill anyone. I'm getting the most per turn. I definitely have the most troops. Hmm. Takes that. If he protects, we know he's holding. Okay, he's not. Okay. I'll just keep taking Ukraine. Because I think Orange will keep taking Ukraine too. <sighs> Who's attacking a lot? Oh. Andy's going to set in right now. Holy frick. That's all his that's all his troops. I'm for sure on that. He doesn't just hit my 60 cap. No, he puts it on the caps in his turn. Okay. He's got four cards. I don't think it's worth breaking him just to open him up and he breaks me again or he takes my capital. So I think I just chill. Take a card and pass. He has a good guard on because like the only way into both of those bonuses is through Greenland. Mm, that's not good because he's going to set in here for me. And that's why I'm not going to open capital 
Mm. He did lose a lot of troops hitting pink, but he got a set in. He's gonna set in again too. Frick. Orange gets a set. He's about a hundred troops now on cap. Did orange get Europe? I doubt it. Yep. Wait, did red get eight? Red got Africa. Orange is attacking a lot, so I'm expect. Yeah, and he opens. That's annoying. Hmm. Oh boy. Okay, let's let's see here. If I don't set now, it's fifty-five. You can set it's then switch to sixty, and he gets a sixty trade. Doesn't hit my forty cap for sure. If orange sets in, he can't hit my 76 cap. I think I'm safe. All right. Red sets in. I bet he takes that capital on Brazil. No. Takes a card and pass. Okay. He got 12 territories. Blue did not attack anything. Much. Oh, but he's tried to take Europe back again. Obviously, he does not keep. Oh. Okay. I think I smashed that. But let's see what blue does here. We have quite a bit of troops. Did, what did blue get? Blue got seven. He has two capitals. Just don't know what the frick's going on over there exactly. Thirteen. I think I go explore on that side. Sets are 70. I need to make this 70. I get 69 for the memes. And we go search. Okay, so we're seeing red in Africa, probably breaking orange every turn, I'm assuming. Red gets eight troops. Nice. That's good. All right. Cool. He wanted to make sure orange was broken. Orange leaving a 20 doesn't make any sense at all. He's just trying to see if I'd break, I guess. Which, I would. Probably broke uh, red just now. No? He's going up through uh, Europe to take it again? Yep, he is. He goes up through Europe, takes it again. Oh, man. 
Orange thinks he's going to keep that with the capital right next to it. That's so funny. It's hilarious. At least we got two players out of the game. I think Blue understands I wasn't really caring about breaking him. He's really slow about taking it back, too. So that's good. Mm, I think Red just keeps breaking. I think I need to find the game upgrade. I think I just do this. Check here. Be a 70. <laughs> Fortify back. Because I know red's going to break. Right? No. What? Red didn't break orange. Wow. Okay. This will just stalemate the game. Okay. I need to get rid of red out of Asia. That is what I need to do get rid of red out of asia yep that is my play okay, good luck with that orange I think red can actually take orange's cap. I think he's big enough too. But he's not, he's just breaking orange, passing. Orange did not get broken. Wait. Huh? Blue's capital has to be on Venezuela. Where's the capital at? Is it? It's in Peru or Argentina then. What? I am a little confused. That threw me off. Orange kept his bonus. Blue, why would you be putting a 47 on Central America if you don't have Brazil? Uh. Okay. Alright, we're at trades of 90, so I make this 90. And I go check. Right? Or do I just... I'm being car blocked. I think I just take a card and pass. I'm not too worried at all. Red and orange have an infinite card drawing spot and I don't think they realize it. Being these two spots, they can infinitely card trade here. Blue, we haven't seen, seen Venezuela yet, so we don't know. He opens me up to him. Only hits me. Oh, he keeps going. He's going to look at my capital. He sees my one two hundred stack. Probably flipping out like how the frick does this guy have so many troops? And fortifies back to capital, giving me access to break him. 
Blue attacks two times. And it's his turn. We'll make this 100. And we'll go break orange. Also want to see red's capital. Okay. Good to see that. It was weird to see that red was not breaking orange. What is Red doing now? He saw my cat. He saw my stack. What is he doing? Is he trying to help Orange? Are they working together? I don't know what I would do in that case. Okay. Really weird spot. Getting all my territory. Okay. Opening my 190. I can tell he doesn't like me. I guess I've been getting a lot of ter I'm getting territory bonus. He's definitely putting that on capital. He's genuinely being annoying at this point. I just don't understand why Red is letting him hold that. Maybe Red is just... The only thing I can think of is Red's like, oh, well, he's letting me hold Africa, so I should let him hold Europe. Well, frick that. It's better that he doesn't have a bonus at all. Blue's only going to hit me. He attacks kind of quickly there. Showing a lot. Still under it, so I'm not worried. We're going to go check to see if that's open, and we're going to break. Yeah, frick you. We don't need that bonus right now. Bonuses are big enough I shouldn't worry, but uh, they're going to stack up. I don't know why orange thinks I can take that. So funny. Like, and blue, blue's not getting his uh, South American bonus. Weird. This is so weird. I haven't seen South America, and I haven't really seen anything in Africa inside of Africa that I can remember unless it happened at the beginning of the game I just didn't see it but we just haven't seen Blue's original capital literally all it is I'm going to make this 120 because I'm going to start making it a little bit bigger every turn. I didn't even have to break orange this turn, so that's good. He doesn't need a bonus. So. I mean, I, w I wouldn't care about a bonus either, but if I could take one, that's great. But taking troops off calf is super risky. So... Hmm. 
Sets in on four. He can't hit my capital. Why would you just suicide? Please don't. Don't be that guy. Please don't be that guy. He's that guy. He is that guy. Guys, I, I want to explain something to you guys right now. I have never been suicided so much in capitals. I played a capitals game yesterday and this is how it ended someone suicided me just like that so i know i have the kill on uh orange i'm gonna guarantee it right now um All right. It's a hundred is the trade in. All right. I'm not against red, so I'll never hit his bonus because it opens his capital up to me every time, even though his capital is already open to me. And blue's getting 12. I need a set right now. I have one. This is a much needed set because. Yeah, I don't want him. I don't want anyone seeing that. We'll make this 120. And the rest here to fortify. We'll fortify it to this one, make him think that it's not that big. And really, it is a 100 stack. Red will not trade in to hit my capital. That would be so dumb. That would be so dumb if he hit this capital right now. Okay, good. Yeah, red knows I'm I'm okay with him. I'm good friends with him. And blue's got a set on five set or five cards, so we're gonna see him set in here. And if he just opened that capital, we're gonna see blue probably go try to take my capital, one of them. Or he's gonna think the Australia's at least opened it for sure. No, he doesn't. Oh man. Oh, so that's for one thirty. I gotta make that thirty. No, no, no. I can wait. Don't need to red open Red's capital. Let him take a card pass. He's getting 12. I think he's still holding North America and South America here. I cannot believe I just got suicided and I'm still alive. Yeah, I think I make it 130 now.
Red's completely chill with me. I bet Blue is going to attack me. I'm completely fine with sitting here. Like this. Oh, I bet he's stacking. Yeah. Three hundred. No, he wants this capital. I knew that might happen. That was really smart for blue. Well done. That Cam Kacha capital will change the game. But me and red trading in Africa is actually a game changer because it's an infinite trading spot that he can't control. He could lose a lot of troops hitting that capital at the top. He's thinking about whether or not he does it or not. Oh, he's checking red's cap first. Oh, he doesn't even, okay. If he isn't set on three, that would be freaking insane. Maybe I should have set it on four to be safe. Oh, is Red gonna break me now? Okay, no, he doesn't. He's completely chill with me. But now I see how many troops that Blue has there. I mean, he's got two capitals. Three capitals is hard to hold, but... What is blue attacking? Oh, he's trying to hold South America. Okay. All right, so trades are 145. Five hundred attack. Cool. He's not open to my capital. I did open him. I bet Blue's capitals are really low with that three hundred thirty-eight stack fat right there. I mean, I did lose a lot when Orange hit me, but I think I'm okay. Of course he hits my three. He doesn't like me right now for some reason. No, I gotta hit here. Take it from behind because, yeah, always take it from behind because it does nothing sitting there. If it's out, yes. Oh, he hits my three this time. Doesn't break me though. He's willing to hit my three and not a one. Oh, I guess he doesn't unlock the three, the 300. That means, oh, I see what he's doing. That's not bad. I think blue goes and takes a capital now. Oh, 
Oh, just 121. Okay. And 55 it is. We'll make it 160. Be safe on that. We'll leave that there. Leaving blue locked in is fine. I need that Middle East capital to win this game. And I'm just going to chill here because I'm not going to do anything to anyone here. So, uh, blue is open that turn. Red open blue that turn. Now, if blue is a set on three, that was perfectly planned. It's red just open blue. I guess it would, he would have been open re regardless on that situation. Blue is super patient to go and take a capital from me. Blue breaks. Okay. We're gonna leave that of yeah. That should be good. Nice. Okay. Blue breaking my bonus was unusual. Never did that before. Oh, now it comes out. Goes back. And he breaks again. I think this is where I break his bonus. Yeah. All right, so that's where the capital is now. Red and blue have the infinite card trading spot, as well as me and red. Red is in the driver's seat of this game. All right. Um... With this being an intermediate plus game, We had a 450 stack. He doesn't really add to it. All right. All right. As long as I can make this exactly, I'm not going to add anything else besides the exact amount. Yeah. He's stacking on his main cap now. Hmm. I could hide a stack and make blue. Blue's playing very... Disembarred the fist. Sounds familiar. Exactly there. We got 
five hundred. Doesn't see it. Red sees it though. Mm. Like, I don't mind blue having his bonus. I just don't know why he needs to break me in anymore. Like, does that matter at all? Why does that matter? Um. So I want to make the Kamkatcha in my main capital, which is my main capital is definitely Middle East. But if blue gets a hold of Kamkatcha, the game will flip. In terms of blue, will be in a powerful position. So red has not broken me not once. Blue has broken me quite a bit. We're going to be sitting here for a while, so... Why is it all to that capital? Very cautious about this process. One eighty five. I could smash that 488, but then red takes the capital from me, which is okay. Red's attacking quite a bit, and I don't see it. Oh. Oh, frick. Blue only gets seven. Honestly, I think hitting that 493 would be super smart right now. That wasn't amazing. Nine. Leave that a fifteen in case he has no set. And if red gets the cap that I'm holding right there in the Middle East, that's completely fine. Oh, he's open. He's open to that. <laughs> There's a cap he can take, but it won't be worth. Okay, well, he started this fight. Red opened. I'd opened him at the weird time as well. And also Red's capital is open to my 276 and it's probably like a thousand cap. I had to guess. You can see the capital I have. I don't think Red knows what he's doing. Nope. Oh, there's an eight. He blocks his capital. Okay, so Red doesn't know what he's doing. Why is he hitting me only? 
I'm not sure. Nope, never mind. He's not hitting me only. Okay. He's opening up blue to me. Nice. Alright. Well, I can give red my capital. And, uh, yeah. Okay. I don't understand why he keeps opening them. That's... It's very annoying. It's taking all the territories like they actually matter. They don't matter. Blues are being a lot more cautious now. That was 400 for now. 200 is the trade in. 205 actually. And then the rest goes there. Sick. Back to an alright spot. Still not good enough for red not to hit me. I need to get it up to about a thousand before I feel comfortable with that capital on Middle East. What is red doing? Okay, that's where I take my card. Blue's also opened my 400 cap at the top right. I doubt I'll ever hit that 400 cap. If he does, that'd be interesting. If blue hits me, we both die. So, red is single stacking while we are doing nothing but hit each other. So, and I. I hit blues off cap troops. You leave troops off cap, I will hit them. I didn't. The roll on that stack was alright. It wasn't amazing though. It could have been better. I definitely could have gotten better positive numbers out of that one. But I did not. All right, now we see red with a 224 stack. He's going to break my bonus for the first time. Oh, wow. What? Now he's like, I want Europe. Okay. And I care less if you wanted Europe, it's fine. I think I can just let him hold it. Yeah, he wouldn't hit that, but he was getting ready to, I bet you. I bet you he wanted to do it. Yeah, I know. I can tell. I'll let red hold your up. Now, if he doesn't break me, I'm going to have to break him. Hmm. No, I'll break blue.
I'll break blue if red doesn't break me. Yeah. Don't want to open this capital. At all costs. Okay. Like that. Oh, red takes off Ukraine. Maybe he just trusts me. And that's good if red trusts me. Oh, blue's going to leave a 129. No? Oh, okay. I break blue again. No, we don't break blue. Because blue's car blocked. Let's see what happens. Break me if you have to, I don't care. I think he's car blocked. I definitely think that red that blue's car blocked right now. And red just car blocked him. No, he got a card. Why'd that take forever for him to play my play his turn? Why did that take him so long to play his turn? Be twenty five took forever. I need to go search around, and see what's going on over here. Row three. Oh, he wasn't blocked. But red wants to make it look like he has the bonus when he doesn't. I'm confused. So blue's never been car blocked. Okay. Hmm. What? Did I get sleep? Yeah. I had like seven hours. All right. I really thought blue was car blocked. For, for sure, I thought so. I'm going to hit that too because I don't know why. It was just weird. Okay. We're at 2.30 now. Six sixty-nine. Yep. This 
is a weird end game. I really thought blue was power blocked for a second. <sighs> I didn't realize he had another stack he was creating to come over to this side for some reason. I don't know why red's acting so weird. I can tell blue is a fast player and is sh trying to, sh to hide it right now. And red, I don't know, I don't know if they're that quick or not. I've never seen that name before, but I think I've seen blue's name before for sure. Isambard. Just Isambard alone sounds familiar. Okay, that was weird. Why would you only take 14 off? Once someone hits someone else's cap, basically they're gonna die. They're basically killing both of each other, so. What's he doing? Yeah, why? When he looked at that one, he's like, oh, frick, you got another big cap. Why hit Japan? Now he's just hitting every territory, and he's being annoying. He wants to see something happen, and he knows I'm the strongest. Alright. <sighs> I like shit. Oh boy. And that happened right when blue was at five cards. Wow. Right when blue was at five cards. Interesting. Really interesting. It's that all in his cap. I think I use this capital to go and uh, 245 is this. I need to get the 245. I'll do that another turn. There we go. Alright. Gonna hit my three. You break me too? What does red want? He wanna he probably wants the Australia capital, but I'm not gonna give it to him. He could have he fortifies off his cap, I'm sure he could probably take it. He's probably got a nice 2,000 stack on that capital in Africa. Most likely he could take it. Like, I don't know why. <sighs> this is a harsh end game because blue and red both don't like me, I can tell. The way they're playing, it's obvious. Blue's stacking up against me for sure. We're at 250. Got 250. Make that the best number ever. The rest here. Take a card and get this. So that they can do their card without breaking me.
And then red continues to break me. I don't know why. Like, he didn't care until now. Blue knew my... No, he's fortifying that over there or something. I don't understand what red wants. Oh my god, this guy. At least the bonuses don't matter. Notice how he doesn't, we don't see him hit blue at all. He's only hitting me every turn. I'm wondering how blue is, or the cards are happening with him. Oh, we see blue. Indonesia. Don't need it. We're at 270, 265. And that can stay at 669. This is going to be a long game. Oh my god. Already an hour and 18 minutes. Red breaks me. Nice. I'm taking hard and pass. I'm already at 2100, so I think Fred's at 2500. And blue is probably, yeah, I don't really know. Break me every turn. Oh, he loses a stack on there. Okay. Still a 14. We're just going to stay here forever. I'm surprised these players are still in this game right now. I'm not going to lie. It's surprising to me. Got to make that at 269. Why not? Hmm. <laughs> 
Oh, this is five out of three. That's what you get for not using slider. Frick you, red. Holy crap. Well, blue's gonna go check the capital now. He sees it. He's like, oh, I could probably hit that. Yeah, I'm not opening that now. Make that that so I'm fortifying it so it doesn't look like I'm actually like doing something weird with it. So, but I'm gonna do this. Watch this. But I'm not gonna hit Cyan. Now, I hope red does not come out because that would be super sus. If we saw him come out right now. I want to point out that I'm not live on stream. So, that's expected. He thinks I have it and he ends his turn. Yep, okay. Now, if he doesn't break me one of these times, that's not good. No, 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 no. You're going to show Red that you're still there. I don't like that. Why is he suiciding? What? Oh, because he's mad I didn't, he doesn't have access to it. Okay. He's mad he doesn't have access to that capital I blocked him. Because I'm too smart. You know, hey, he wants that. Yeah, frick you. You're never getting it, bro. You made the mistake of going and checking the capital. You're never gonna open it. Red thinks he's open to it, and he's not. He might be. He might be able to take my 669 capital. I don't know how big that stack is there, but he might be able to. I probably think with this five set in, he might be able to take it. Oh, he's just gonna suicide it. No? What are you doing? Okay. Why does he only wanna hit me? That's so stupid. I'm so confused with this blue player right now. Like he hates me more than anything. Oh, I ruined that, oh well. Oh, jeez, man. I think I'm going to start stacking troops behind so he has no idea. He's blocked off from this one. I think I make this 700. He doesn't see that capital, so he just he didn't he doesn't know if I added to that or not. So that's the good thing about it.
I'm waiting for him to fortify to that capital at the bottom with this trade in once it gets big enough and then I'll just pop another 271 right on, right on it and him be like what what's going on whoa 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 that looks weird it's right before his set too whoa that 271 is nothing oh my yeah he's gonna take that capital now no way he doesn't what blue didn't go take it does he want this one I'm definitely fortifying it to there now. What is, why is red keep taking all these territories? What in the world? Red is playing super smart. Like, what the frick? Because blue is only wanting to hit me, and I don't really care about what the frick he wants. So. That's our 300, so I'm going to make this double now. So whatever it is, I double it. I make sure it's double the amount. And that's already more than double, so I don't hear about it. Cool. We're going to check this stack over here. Cool. These two players are quite interesting. They're both ganging up on me. Maybe I need to give up the capital. Maybe giving up the Australian capital would just help ease. Nope. I don't understand. It's like red and blue are ganging up on me. I know I have three capitals, but he's going to go try and take it. <laughs> I mean, he had enough troops to hit it, but apparently not to him. That was more than double. He didn't set in for that, though. Frick you red. You're annoying as frick. Oh my god, he hits every territory. Like why? Why do you feel the need to do that now? Oh frick, I feel like I'm gonna lose if I don't give that capital up. What? Okay.
Lou's getting more than I a turn. Yeah, let's make sure we're double, so 320. So we're gonna make this 640. I don't think I need to make this more because I don't want to lose this cap. This is a valuable cap. That's not as much as a valuable cap, but yeah, you get the point. Oh no, we hit this guy. I really don't understand what uh, blue and red want at the moment. It's really weird. All of this. How the, how red's doing it too. If I'm going to give this capital on the right, the bottom right, away, I would not give it to red. I would give it to blue. Because if I give it to red, then blue will just only hit me. I don't know. That's hitting every territory. Quite annoying. And I feel like if I hit territories, he just suicides like everyone else does when they get mad. And that's just so stupid. I've already gotten suicided once by orange this game, so. I feel like if someone were to want to leave, they would suicide me. And that would be so dumb. This is going to take forever. Six seventy. I might as well give blue the Australia cap if I'm trying. Do it. This would be a good time too as well. In late game, I would always be, you'd always hold that though.
Oh boy. These two players, man, they're so weird. I know red's bigger than both of us, so that's one thing. Oh, he still wants to go take that capital. Looks like he's trying to take that one, though. And I really don't want him to take this one. Like, I don't mind the Australia one, but... It's, uh... This one and these two, I just need to I need to keep both of these. So Fifty-five. All right. Better to pull this out. Red would rather hit my three. I think he actually hits the one though. Yeah, he, he hits these territories every turn. Yeah, dude, just red player, man. Frick. <laughs> Now, if red bots, that would freaking be wild. I think I might start soaking up turns just because this is like. No, I'm not gonna stall. Add a hundred to here. Rest over here. Oh my god.
Okay. Red didn't hit that blue one this time in Afghanistan. That's 385. That makes it 70. Five thousand troops now. Red just moved. Red moved the stack. Interesting. He's got another 1200 stack there in uh, Great Britain. He's got barely anything on capitals right now. Blue does. 
I know I can't cap from because red has a ginormous stack on North Africa. Probably at least 4,000 on capital. So I cannot cap red at the moment. Oh, blue's hitting red. Oh. So I think this is the point where I go and check what the fuck's going on. And we don't hit red just in case he... Okay. That's really weird. They completely cleared. Basically, Asia is empty. I could just take Asia back now. I don't know why red needs to be inside of Asia. Like this, it's weird. Okay. Mm. It's weird that blue moved back right when I said that about the stacks. Like I said, I'm not live on Twitch. No one can hear me. I bet Blue's capitals are nice and big again. Maybe he's just annoyed that I like saw his 17 stack. I, he just moved it, that 17 stack, back onto a capital, I bet. I think I go and wipe this, all of it. I hated all that clutter, clutter, so I got rid of it. It was kind of agitating to look at, I'm not gonna lie. So, oh look at that, red sets it on three. Takes a, he smashed blue. Red smashed blue stack. Yeah, that 100% just happened. So we're seeing action go on. I think after all this, I am stronger than red and blue. Not combined, just stronger than both of them. Like, one of them. Girl, fist bump. Oh wow, 3,000. Okay, opened up a 3,000 cap. I'm glad I looked at it. He has about 4,500 troops. Thousand less than me and red, or at least than me. And red's capital is probably about a four thousand or more. Yeah, 
I think Red has all his troops on cap though. So that means he's got like at least 4,500 on cap. Maybe 4,700 because of all the extra troops he's been getting recently. Blue's probably really annoyed with me. And red, apparently. Okay. Oh, he's just tied over the red, it looks like. Okay. Alright. We are at 415, so I need to put this at 830. Double the trade-ins. Let's take a card here. He's getting 14. I think he's got both right now. He's gonna break me. He card skipped. He's that. He just gave up a bunch of troops by card skipping. Him card skipping literally gave up a hundred and something troops right there. But that shows that he's willing to trust me. Red want or blue wants red to come through, I think. Holy crap, 2400. Yeah, they split that off. They split that off cap. Unless they had it hiding behind their cap and split it off. I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I haven't seen their cap in a long time. So red, red must be a really good player. It's just really bad that their stacks off capital. Okay. This is so weird. <sighs> Did not expect the game to be going this long. I guess I shouldn't play Intermediate Plus when I'm going on Classic. Maybe that's the problem. Oh, he expects me. I see what Blue is doing. Well done. Forces me to set in when I have it so that I can continue. Keep holding my relationship with Red. I 
And I'm not going to want my stack offside that. Lou's very patient and has lost his stacks quite a lot. He's not smart about how he's using his troops in terms of where they are. Instead of putting them on cap, whoa. But he's gonna block me again. Yeah, he did. Alright, I bet Red's not going to be happy, he can make me whatever. Alright, you don't have to keep going bro. I was forced to hit, to hit you, so. He gave me a bunch of cards, so that's one thing. Uh-oh. Red loses another 100 troops. Yeah, Red loses another 100 and something troops from that no card. That's two cards Red's missed. It's like he did that on purpose because he did a 2v1. That's stupid.
What is he doing? Blue's playing this very well. So I missed one. We're at nine ten now. Thirty five hundred now for this guy. The rest on here. Yeah, we're gonna go white ball this because get the frick out, red. We don't need to do that. That's in. Honestly, do not mean to make that capital that number, not gonna lie. getting it Why are you hitting so much, Red? Oh my god, you're being annoying. Wants to check my capital? Like, frick you. Uh oh. Good game. Was said. He's gonna suicide it, it sounds like. I'm not opening capitals to myself at all. Blue doesn't know what to do right now. I've never seen... I don't think I've seen someone say good game in a while like that. I've never seen Red even respond. So that is wild. Red said good game. How many trips did he get? Nine. Oh. Oh. He lost that giant stack in Iceland. That is what's going on. They're both very weak. Maybe I should check Red's capital.
blues I'm more scared of blue because they can attack quickly, but red's pretty smart. Red does anything, who knows? Never want to open up red to my capital directly through Africa. <sighs> blue? What does blue want to do now? Could car block him right here. But I'm gonna leave red to it. Red just red has only got that. This is all red has right now is this twenty nine hundred. Completely going off cap. Nothing on this cap. Oh my, that's game. Yeah, good game. That is it. Yep, 100% GG. All right. He gave him five cards though. He gave blue five cards. I don't think it meant, oh, well he put it on cap, so I guess it doesn't matter. There's an open cap right now on Northwest Territory. Blue's probably gonna take it though. Oh yeah, red's dead. Game. If I can, I'd rather kill blue first or red. Well, you better get rid of red now or else I'll kill him first. He probably will, he's got plenty of time. I'm just messing around with that. Oops. I think blue gets the kill though. Yeah. Yep, there it is. Kill him on Northwest and in the game. That went a lot quicker than I thought it would. He botted. <laughs> but yeah, this guy botted. All right. I did not like playing with blue. That went quick because of red and blue. This is why you be patient in the late game. Be patience gets you the win. All right. That was quite a game. I'm expecting at least one or two grandmasters in this one because for red and blue to be that patient wow blue played very well red was very patient but taking territories very weirdly blue grandmaster expected red intermediate i actually kind of expected them to be a in a master 
We had orange is an expert, white is a master, and pink is an intermediate. Pink died not that fast. Who died fast? It was the person who had their capital on Australia. I killed, we basically killed them because orange went for that and failed. And it really did not work out, so I killed, I killed, I took White's capital and killed him outside, so I can get the troops every turn. Wow, what a game! That is crazy. Well, if you liked, please subscribe and like the video, um, and follow me on Twitch. I um, will be live on Monday. So, anyways, Flat as Justice is his name. I didn't even see that. Is Simbard the Fist 23 I've seen before? I don't remember who that is, though. Red responded weirdly by saying good game. And, which is something I would say. So, anyways, well, we beat a Grandmaster, an Expert, a Master, and two Intermediates. I'll take it. How much do we jump up? Uh, basically a thousand. Yeah. So, alrighty. If you enjoyed... I'll see you guys later. I already said that. So, peace.